another video. We're going to be talking about Mullen stock, ticker symbol MULN for Mullen Automotive and how Mullen can reach a dollar. There'll be two different ways, okay? We're going to go to levels. We're also going to go over the news, the stock extension, when is the deadline for the stock extension. And also remember, this is very important. Make sure you follow me on Instagram. Now be careful. There are fake Instagrams. This is why I'm showing you. Some of the fake ones have like underscores after the E. Some of the fake ones have like two E's or three L's. Make sure it's will.knowledge. That is it. 1843 followers only following one person. Okay. Make sure this is the only Instagram you're following. I do not want you to get scammed. Any other Instagram besides the one I'm showing you right here is fake. Okay. I'm telling you now. So we're going to go over levels on Mullen and we're also going to go over the extension news. So smash the like button, subscribe if you are new. Thank you guys for being here. If you want to update on Mullen uh, Monday, whenever the market opens, all you got to do is get the video over 150 likes. Now, as we know, Mullen did have an extension, 180 day extension, and that's going to bring it out to about September 6th, right? And we're in April. So we got May, June, July, August, then September. So we got about four to five months until that deadline is going to be reached. Now, this is one way they can reach a dollar is by doing a reverse stock split, right? That's one way. That's not the way we would like because it's just going to shoot it up right to a dollar. What we would like is it actually going up to a dollar. But that being said, it's going to take a lot for Mullen to do that. So the first way is a reverse stock split. The second way is actually the stock moving higher. Now, we had positive news comes out. It did not really affect Mullen. Remember the previous times we had all good news coming out this way. It actually affected Mullen and Mullen kept going higher. But once it started breaking, like 26 cents was a key support. We kind of knew that it was going to be going down and we kind of just wanted to wait till it actually found some type of support, which it could be finding down here. Remember this level I gave you guys at 10 cents that has not broken this level in like a week or two, which is good. We also closed Friday. Uh, well, Friday was closed. We closed Thursday on a green day, which is also good. OK, so now we're going to go over some levels on Mullen. Make sure you guys don't forget to use that code 19 off to get 19 percent off your first month. Either apprentice, elite or VIP. Get all my buys and sales. Teach you guys how to trade private live streams, bonus YouTube videos, key levels on any stock. I trade options literally every day and we literally almost win them every time. You can ask anybody in the team membership. I think it's a great way to bring in consistent profit. And that's literally all you can do. Right. You don't have to worry about nothing else. Link in the description. Use that code 19 off. I think that code ends Sunday at midnight and then the code will be over now levels. I do have a target of 18 cents, but we do have some room to go, right? So we have a support level down here at 10 cents. We have a resistance level at about 12 cents, but I'm going to give you guys two levels we got to break. The first one is 12 cents, okay? And the second one is about 15 cents. These are two significant levels we must break to start moving to the higher side because these are resistance levels. The only way we know Mullen wants to go up if this fit starts breaking resistance levels. It did here. But it really didn't break anything significant, right? That's why I wasn't trying to buy just yet. We got to wait for that confirmation. So these are the levels I'm kind of watching out for. We have to break these levels. I wish Mullen would go up off just pure price of just pushing it up. I'm pretty sure a lot of people are shorting it right now. So even if Mullen can push, I believe shorts will have to cover if Mullen can start pushing above 15 cents. I don't think they'll have to cover with just a 12 to 12 cents because that's kind of a smaller move. But if we can push all the way up to like 15 and actually start breaking up, they're going to have to cover those shorts, which are actually going to push it up even more, which I do like. Yes, we have some good news of the Menzies pilot of the LAX um, at the airport. They just wanted some stuff fixed, but overall they might order those bands. So that is good news, but we're not really seeing any push off of news, right? So we're going to have to see what really pushes Mullen then we'll know how high Mullen can go. If it goes off news, then we have to continuously get good news. If it goes off pure price, that will be even stronger, I believe, because pure price is pushing up with no news or nothing. Then when news comes out, it's just going to be that extra push to push it up even higher. So watch these levels for Mullen right now. There is no clear buying level on here until maybe we break 12 cents. Then probably I'll see a clear buying level on Mullen. OK, so that's what I'm looking at. Smash the like button and subscribe. And always remember, no recommendation of ours. So anything, just for educational purposes only. So do not trade anything you see or hear in a video. Catch you guys in the next one.